Hi, my name is Commando Enley. I'm a young barber in the business. It's been 10 years I'm in the industry right now. I've been cutting hair in my garage. And now I'm having my barber shop right now. In five years, I, I see myself more like uh, in the industry as an edu educator because what I learned by cutting hair is that I help a lot of people. I change a lot of lives and I want to spread this thing all across the world. So I'm learning Spanish, Japanese, I speak French, English, Portuguese a little bit. I'm trying to uh, learn the more that I can with the language so I can change more lives with a haircut or with teaching people how to do a haircut. Because in a lot of countries, people uh, have, have faith, they, they have the power to do so many things. And me, as a good educator, someone that can teach people, I can change people's lives and that's about it. Uh, I'm, never, I'm not gonna go on my top five. I'm gonna say the, the only barber, the, one of the barber that motiv motivate me the most, it's Taylor Cuts. Because I met this guy and I was scared to go to his salon because it was the biggest like barber shop that everybody know on the internet. So when I went to LA, I went in front of the shop and I was scared to go in. When I went in, I met the guy and we had a connection. And the guy took his time to talk to me took this time to explain me everything and I asked the guy one question how can I be a better barber and he was like you have to love yourself first at first I didn't understand but after time I started to realize that this guy just helped me only with like a, a sentence because when you love yourself everything you're gonna do is gonna be more like real so if you're cutting hair and you don't love what you do and you don't love and you do it for the money, you do it for anything, maybe you're gonna have good haircuts, but you're never gonna be the best version of yourself. Instead of if you love yourself, you're gonna cut hair, give love to everybody and you're gonna spread your love all around your customers and everything and you're all gonna be protected after. So, and you're gonna love your job because as a barber, I don't even feel as a bar uh, uh, like a barber. I really feel like a, a psychologue because you hear every story of the people, you know, all the story, except uh, um, with the COVID, it was really hard for me as a barber, but my clients too, it was hard for them. So as a barber, if I love myself, I can make other people love themselves. I can help other people work on themselves. So, yep, that's about it. My, the barber that I like the most is Taylor Cuts because this guy really loves himself and you can see it. You can see it in his work and how he is. He, this, he's the same guy in the internet and in the real life. He's just so real that I, it's, it's just amazing. As a barber, you always want a clipper that's gonna stay all day on. And with my clipper, I have the two hours with the clipper and I have three hours with the trimmer. It's simply the best clipper for me because as a barber, I travel all across the world. And what I like is to have consistent power. And with the high torque that we have in those clippers and trimmers, they are the best. For me as a barber, I only fuck with this. And with the custom effects, as you can see, you can even custom your clipper like you want. So me as a barber, Baby, this for me is the best thing in the world. Yeah, baby. <laughs> L'académie m'a permis de vraiment me concentrer sur moi-même, euh, faire augmenter ma clientèle. J'ai vraiment multiplié ma clientèle de comme 2, 3. Et ça m'a appris, ça m'a appris comme comment bien transmettre le savoir aux autres personnes. Comme là, par exemple, maintenant, j'ai pu ouvrir moi-même ma propre académie avec ce que Commando m'a appris. Donc là, je transmets mes connaissances aux autres personnes pour que eux aussi ils puissent s'élever à mon niveau, même plus haut préférablement. Puis pour eux aussi transmettre les connaissances, etc. As a legacy, I want I want to do it for my community. I want to do it for every black entrepreneur that are scared, that I that, that was born. Because you know, as a black guy, you always you always um, I don't know how to say it in English, but they always teach you not do this, do not do this, do not do this. So at long term in your mindset, you're going to be scared to do anything that you want in your life. But if you break that thing and you push through all your goals, you can reach that level. Simply day by day, work on yourself on a daily basis and you will reach that level. 
So for me, for my legacy, every people that know me, I'm never going to stop. That's why every day I'm saying the grind never stop. No matter what, if my car is going to be broke, if my bike going to be broke, I have to continue because that's the only way to success. So for me, I want to leave for my legacy. I want to motivate every person that know me. They can reach any level that they want if they really try hard.